have a good day. Oh, hello. Everything foot bag here. And today, all that I plan on doing right here, right now. Make the LA Beast a foot bag. Why? Because the LA Beast is freaking awesome for sending me these items. And you know what? Are they in safe hands? Absolutely. Without further ado, let's get started. All right, so this started about a year ago when the LA Beast mentioned that he had a P.O. box for fan mail. So I sent him this box of Josh's Jacks and he mailed me back an autographed photo and drew me a picture and wrote me a full handwritten letter and really just went above and beyond anything that I could have imagined. Not too many YouTubers take that much time and put in that much effort for their fans. So I really just wanna make him this footbag to say thank you. Now I know Beast is a bigger dude, so I'm gonna make him a slightly larger bag, probably a little over two inches. It's gonna be a pro style 32 panel, so it's a little time consuming. The same bag I made in the store video took four hours and 48 minutes. So my goal here was to beat that time. So I chose red and blue for the colors. The LA Beast is a Bills fan and he's done a lot of work with Pepsi. So these colors just make sense. Inside the bag, uh, that's that's how it was sealed. That is exactly what it looks like inside. Uh, and again, if you want to see what the inside of the bag. Enough with the inside of the bag. Okay. Now I chose mostly metal for the fill, just so it would be nice and dense and have a low fill percentage. I added some sand in to help it mix well and also threw in some rubber just to give it some extra pop and to get the percentage up to where I wanted it. It just makes an overall great bag. It's super easy to kick and saw. One of the hardest parts about making a larger bag with small panels is trying to get all that fabric through that one small hole when you're flipping the bag inside out. And after I tighten up these final stitches, all I have left to do is tie it off, hide the threads, and it's time to test it out. You know what looks good to me. Now I got this bag done in four hours and 46 minutes, which was only a two minute improvement, but I'm super happy with the finished product. So now it's time to test it out and ship it off. And if you're interested in learning more about Footbag, please check out my other videos. And thanks for watching. Have a good day. Yes, heck yeah.